Hello and welcome back to Conan Exiles. And we're on the Conan Exiles main map in our base just next to the New River, which is just here. And today we are going to go and continue this sacred hunt business. Because we've been collecting, well, we've been killing off werewolves and collecting their teeth. And I think we've got enough to go back to uh, this chap up here, or rather this sort of temple place here and pick up some lures. I think we need some lures. And we need some body armor as well. No, not, not body armor, body paint. That gives us a nice buff. I think that's how it works. I've been doing a little bit of work here. I'm gradually building up this light little village. And over here, I've got like a storage area. And this is a Zingaran tent, which I'm quite fond of. This is something from the Battle Pass. And yes, yeah, quite nice. I've just put a rug in there for the time being. I can't remember if you've seen this, but I've got some archers up there. I've been building up the defences on this base somewhat. Uh, yeah, it's working out quite well. In the last episode, we were trying to get hold of a barkeeper, and I continued doing purges till I got one, and I got them straight away, to be honest with you. I've now got three barkeepers. Let's go up here and have a look. Well, I mean, nothing you haven't seen before, but you might as well have a, a gander. So there he is. <laughs> Here's the rotten patrons. Oh, yeah, there's this guy, isn't there? Zil the Wanderer, who I think has got something to do with the, uh, the Sacred Hunt quest. So let's just talk to him. I know a hunter when I see one. Oh, yeah. Uh, talk. Give me a wild place. Give me wind whispering deadly secrets in the branches. Give me a gravid moon hanging heavy in a hungry sky, setting my teeth on edge and my toes curling in the clay of blood and soil. Right, anything else? That being said, <laughs> I'm rather enjoying this warm place to rest and recover. Yeah, he's all talk. I feel a vague ache and weariness. Perhaps it is the climate. I am a stranger in a strange land. Mm. Anything else? No matter. Let us indulge in libation. And palaver. Right, so he's begging for free drinks, I think. Mm, you have a hunger about you. God, does this go on for much longer? I wonder. I wonder if you are on the hunt. I wonder if you seek the sacraments of Jebal Sag to slay his champions. And claim his blessing. Okay. <sighs> you are no scavenger. No jackal. You aspire to the apex. You desire the beast lord's greatest champion. Okay, I believe you. Yes, this... Current grand champion of Jebal Sag is not quite right, are they? <laughs> Too powerful. Some dark magic possesses them, yes? I've not the faintest idea what he's on about. I wonder. I wonder at the nature of gods. How growing divinity turns them into a multiplicity. How oh, each of their extremities might gain agency, like a worm's cloven head becoming two. Oh, dear. More? <laughs> I think these pleasant libations have fogged my mind with philosophizing, though not unpleasantly so. Right, so I think we're coming to the end. No doubt others well, have not. offered you advice on how to deal with this corrupted champion. I offer you an alternative. Right. 
A predator should not Jesus. only be mighty, but cunning. You could face this possessed champion head on, or you could cleanse it of the corrupting influence. I got some tips. In a dark, forgotten place, seek out a primeval hyena who walks as a man. One of Jebal Sag's first champions. Lure this beast out of its ancient slumber. Use its elder blood to further season your lures. Consuming this mixture will purge the corrupted champion. I'm not really getting this at all. I have enjoyed our conversation. Oh, okay, this is the end then. Cozy watering hole. I wish you success on your hand. Okay, I wish you'd been a bit clearer about what I've got to do. Let's uh, learn this corruption thing. Learn lure corruption. Um, did he have anything else to say? Give me no, no. A Goodbye. Wild Thank place. you. Thank you, sir. Give me wind. Thank you. Good God. Whispering deadly. Right. I didn't really understand any of that. <laughs> Not a word. What I do know, though, is that we've got to take our teeth, the teeth we've been collecting, and go up here, as I said. And I think we have to buy a lure, buy some body paint, and then there's three champions to take down. And there's one champion all the way up here in the north, I think. Then there's another one. There's one over here, I'm pretty sure, around there. Oh, and the last one is... Here, yeah, that's the Black Hand Galleon. But I thought what we would do is go up to the cold, because we've got this nice, hang on, we've got this nice sword now. We've got the Eye of the Watcher, which is a sword with an eye attached to it, and that's very nice. And it's cold resistant. It's not a great sword, but it is cold resistant. So if we come across any really severe cold patches, we can use that to get out of it. What we'll do, we will take Lee in here, because he's my best troll. We'll get him a little bit more healing. We'll get him some more healing, and then we shall take one of the horses, and we shall ride up into the desert, and go and try and buy these things. So anyway, let's just pick up some gruel. That should be enough. And then we shall get going. Right, here's your food, sir. Now, which one should we take? Uh, this is... Uncle 2. Oh! Well, he's got potion in him. What's that potion? Come off. What is this stuff? Potion of endowment. I have no idea why I put that on you. I have no idea at all. Anyway, let's get going. Unless something dramatically interesting happens, I will cut around this bit. But uh, yeah, I shall see you in the northern desert. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I've just remembered something. We made ourselves a map room, didn't we? We made ourselves a bloody map room. <laughs> I'm so used to riding everywhere. I'd completely forgotten. What we can do is go and visit uh, one of the obelisks that's quite close to the den. Damn it, I'd almost forgotten all about that. It's ridiculous, really. Right, I'll show you this as well. Let's get off the horse here. It's easier to climb up. Come off. Come off. Climb up here. Yeah, I made myself this Lemurian brazier. It's huge, isn't it? It's absolutely massive. I've got this one here. There's another one over there. Okay, Lin's enjoying himself somewhere. What <laughs> yo? And there's another one further down the coast. But yeah, I can't remember. Well, you know, I cheated. I sort of admin these in. But I obviously know how to make them. But I can't remember where you learn the recipe for those. But here's the map room, and we learnt how to make a map room a couple of episodes ago. And we should be able to go all the way up to... There we go, that's the one we want, isn't it? Yeah, so that is quite close to the place we want to be. Where's Leon? Where is he? Leon? Oh, there he is, behind the horse. Right, let's get going. This takes us to the Shattered Springs, I think. Good. Well, there. Yeah, so this is, well, the Shattered Springs are over there. This is, well, let's come away from that. 
That is, if I can remember it. Where are you? Yeah, Clayel's stronghold. Rather interesting dungeon there. But if we go around the corner. Pop, pop, pop. Right, there's the Shattered Springs. What we want to do is just go over there. Where that light in the sky is. Pop. Yeah, we'll head towards that. So we're almost there. There we are. There we are. So we've got to chat to these nice people and buy some stuff. Alright, let's come off. Run round. It's the guy on the right has stuff to sell. We can ignore the werewolves. Hello, sir. Lovely weather for a hunt, eh? <laughs> Uh, let's trade. Happy hunting. <laughs> right, I think this is what I want. War paint, Jebel Sag Hunter. Uh, I don't know what... Hang on. I don't know what Potion of the Hunt is. But we want... Yeah, we got loads of teeth. Uh, how many teeth have we got? We've got 69 teeth, so more than enough. So if we get some war paint... Um, trade. Yes, I've got one. I'll get a couple of those. Not sure how long they last. They might you know, wear out quite quickly. So I've got three. We've got the Champion Lure. Ten. I'll take a couple of them. Oh, I might as well buy three, actually. So we will need three, won't we? We won't do three in this episode, but... We won't do all three, but we'll take another one of these wall paints. And we'll come down and do a potion of the hunt. Oh, damnation. Come on. I don't know what the potion is. But we've got two of those. How many more teeth have we got? Well, we've got 29 teeth. Let's get another potion. Oh, actually, a potion that allows communication with Jebel Sag. Um, do we want to do that? <laughs> Perhaps don't want to do that straight away. I'm not sure that that's got anything to do with the hunting we're about to do. But I'm pretty sure that we do need these lures. So there's a champion's lure. Um, where's the body paint? Nice, okay, well, you know, I don't know what I'm doing really. But I feel we're heading in the right direction. So what we're going to do now, we're going to go into the cold north. We are here, so if we just, yeah, we'll go up through the ruins of old Nabuthu, whatever it's called, and then just go up, yeah, just head up through here, that's, that's a big old frozen lake, and then we've got to get through a forest, and then there's the ice temple there, so let's get going, uh, yeah, straight ahead, and there's like a tunnel through these ruins up there. But once we're beyond this, it's sort of unknown territory for this playthrough. Oh no, we can't get through there. Okay. <laughs> uh, it's up there, isn't it? There we go. That's what we want. Well, I'm very hungry and very thirsty, it seems. I've got loads of food on me, though. So once we get up here... Once we get up here, I'll have something to eat. This is the way through. There we go. Thank goodness for that. Tyros's Passage. It's quite a good building location, this. I've never built here, but I've seen loads of people have had bases here. There we go. I think this is the first time we've been in this neck of the woods. Anyway, let's get something to eat before we die. Uh, yeah, I've got some hearty stew. I'll have that in a minute. Some salted pork. I'll save that for a fight. Shredded roast, that's always good. So we'll whiz around here. We might as well attune ourselves with the... Um, yeah, there's an obelisk in the Mounds of the Dead we've not attuned ourselves with yet. So that'll be useful. And that's on our way. There's the watchtowers on the right. Are they the watchtowers or the ward towers? Something like that. Yeah, lots of boars here, but nothing too dangerous. Yeah, come on, buck it up. Buck it up, horsey. Let's get going. It's 
So we will be crossing some water in a second. We can have a drink there. There we go. There's usually a big elk hanging around. I'm not seeing him. Oh, there he is. <laughs> right, come off. Come off. I want a drink. There we go. It's looking very misty today. Come on, you. Let's get up there. Let's get going. There we are. That's our very first glimpse of the very cold north. So we'll be heading in that direction quite soon. But here's the Mounds of the Dead. And the obelisk is... Yeah, there we go. And the obelisk is just on the other side. So we'll go and say hello to that. There's old Braga, the Sumerian, in the middle there. He's got something to say for himself. We won't visit with him today, though. We'll just go up here. Climb up. Attune ourselves, and then carry on. Thank you. Gaining corruption. Yeah, let's watch this, please. Thank you. Down we come. Down, down. Yeah, we only picked up a smidge of corruption then. So we're okay. Here we go, there's the light spy there. Quite a nice little landmark, isn't it? So we've got to basically go straight ahead through there. Get going. Are we going to pick up any more locations? I mean, all these are learnable locations, but I don't know if we're going to get close enough to set them off or not. Oh, OK, OK, OK. There's a berserker hangs about down here. He's quite dangerous. He makes a very good throll, but I don't want to get tangled up with him, really. Not right now. There's nothing I can do with him. Right, let's not get lost. We've got to go up here. Hope Leon's okay. No sounds of violence behind me. And up here. Yeah, now we start meeting all sorts of big saber tooths and mammoths and whatnot. It all gets rather unfortunate. Oh, there's a bear as well. I forgot about you. Damn it, I'm lost. I can't remember where I'm going. Right, we've got to go down here. Damn it, saber tooth. So this is what we want. This is what we want. Oh, I'm out of stamina on the damn horse. Right, come on, get off quickly. Yeah. No. <laughs> get away from the saber tooth. That is the most important thing. Some big old elks. Oh look, bloody hell! What happened to you? What the hell happened to you? Who have you been fighting with? That's mental. I didn't hear him fighting anyone. Jesus H. Well, the enemy we're going to meet is going to be very tough. Are you going to be able to handle it? Crap. Damn, okay, let's get going. Here's that lake I was telling you about. So we just have to get over here, and then the forest beyond it, I can't remember what it's called, begins with an F or something like that. Oh, man up on the right. Yeah, let's just get going. Right, it's cold here, but it's not very, very cold. We've just got to head... Oh, Eyelit Lake. Okay, good. And there's some ghosts here as well, which are quite fun. Let's save the stamina, because there's loads of saber-tooths in this forest. Right, I'm very cold now, but we should be okay if we just carry on. It doesn't get extremely cold here, I don't think. Right, Frost Needle Forest. That's the name I was trying to think of. No, okay, I can't see anything. Damn it, another saber tooth. Let's slow down a little bit. Oh, let's come down here. Run, run faster than that. Right, some giants, frost giants, the first we've seen in the game. 
Is that good? Well, let's go around the corner. Oh, I hope Leon's all right. Some black ice over there. Right, here we go. Yeah, the creature we're going to fight is actually like a corrupted mammoth. Or actually, I don't know if it's corrupted or not, but it's a really nasty mammoth. So we might get killed. That is a possibility. I'm not sure if I brought enough materials to make a mat with. Frozen slopes. Right, there's a mammoth. If you go around the corner, Leon should be behind me, I hope. Can I get up here? Right, there's Leon. Right, okay, we can get through there. Right, there's a frost temple down there. Here's another obelisk. Very convenient. Go. Let's go and get the frost temple on the map. We might as well. Right, it's very cold. Still okay, though. We don't need the sword up here, I don't think. You only need some, you know, additional protection against cold. If it gets extremely cold. But there's something to learn over here on the right. We interact with this, like, totem pole. These are, I think, veneer or azia totems we can learn. Totems! Good, good. Let's get this on the map. Temple of Frost. I think it does get extremely cold in here. Hello. And there's this. Learn kneel by crom, pray sitting, pray standing. I've forgotten about that. Yeah. Right, come away. Oh, well, let's take him down then. Uh graceful night. We might as well. <laughs> Right, extremely cold, damn it. Um, we've got frostbite. Suffering now. Uh, let's get this up there. Can I put this on? Is that going to work? No, it doesn't seem to be. Um, where's my health? Take one of those, please. Right, that did a little bit of good. Damn it. All right, I'm extremely cold still. I've got my sword, though. I've got my sword. I'm just very cold now. The sword is rubbish. This sword is crap. Oh, I thought that sword would be a lot better. Thank you, Leon. You really saved my chips then. You really did. Ah, oh, let's go and rob this bastard. Let's take that. Have I got any spicy food on me? I should have a little bit. I forgot to bring... Well, I forgot to specially bring some spicy stuff, but... That's hearty stew. I'm sure I have got some spicy something somewhere. Or perhaps I don't. I'm so ill-prepared, it's pathetic. Ah. Right, let's get the healing up where we need it. We've got the concentrate extract there. Let's get rid of that stupid thing. Here's the aloe extract. Um... Get rid of that. Well, we should be okay. Now the lure is around here somewhere. Or rather there's a stone, a little altar. Put the lure on. Damn, where is it? Oh, it's a little while since I researched this. I can't really remember what anything looks like. <laughs> Come on this way. I can't remember what I'm looking for now. It's like a funny looking stone. Have I run right past it? Probably have. Now I chopped down a tree to get some branches to help me make another mat. So I've made a mat so I can put that down somewhere. But it's getting quite annoying finding this bloody um, altar stone. I don't think it's very big. I think it's like boulder size. But it should be obvious, or at least I hoped it would be. It's not turning out that way. Right, I can see it, I can see it. I think I was running straight past it. It is quite close to the temple. It's that thing there, and we have been running past that loads of times. <laughs> Damn. Now, I'm a little bit concerned 
that this clothing I'm wearing might give... Um, it doesn't seem to give much... It does give a bit of cold protection, you see. So what's going to happen when this comes off? Because what you're going to do, you're going to fight these rotten animals naked. Ah. Uh, am I going to start freezing? Okay, well, let's just take it off. See what happens. Right, come on, let's try and take it off. Um... I'm very cold. I seem to be okay, though. Oh, I want a drink, really, but if I do, I will get too cold, I think. I'll take something to eat. Might as well. Uh, let's get some enhanced cruel down. That should do something. Right, oh yeah, that should do something for the thirst as well. Right, bit nervous about this. Bit nervous. I have put a mat down. Lean is going to be bearing the brunt of this, I think. But let's try and find one of these lures. Here we go. Let's put this down over here. And I think we just put a lure on that. Huh? No, go and do something. What do I do with this? Alright, okay, like that. Ah! Damn it! I haven't put the wall paint on. I haven't put the wall paint on. Quick, 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 quick! Run away! Apparently, this is very good, this stuff. Damn it! Leon, Leon, get him! Uh, put the wall paint on. Yeah, I've got it on now. Right, let's try and join in a little bit. Uh, let's try with the bow and arrow first. No ammo. <laughs> let's not do that then. Damn, I'm all over the place. Greg's full night. If Leon looks like he's going to really suffer, we've got to, we've got to get out of here. I'm not risking Liam. I've stopped healing. I've really took a lot of health then. Damn, this guy's a tank. Damn it! Crap! This wall paint's not doing very much at all, is it? Damn! Go away! Um, let's try it. Yeah, there we go. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Liam seems to be okay. Bloody hell! Oh. Get him! Slash and slash and slash. Run away a little bit. Right, take some more aloe. Take some more aloe. Quick, quick, quick. Get it down you. Lean's managing. Oh, we're not winning though. We are not winning. Back off. Right, I'm extremely cold now. That's not fair. <laughs> no, I don't think it's going to work out. No, I'm dead. I'm dead. Uh, bedroll, please. Bedroll. Oh no, I think this is too much for us. I think we might have to come back some other time. <laughs> Blood Crystal Golem? Really? That's not... Is that what it is, officially, a Blood Crystal Golem? Where's my poor body? Um, can't see myself. There we go. We must be around the corner. Look at you, you horrible brute. Oh, look! What is... Damn! That's weird, isn't it? Come on. Uh, let's take it all, please. Peculiar. I forgot there was a golem up here. We might as well get him. Get ya. Look at me with that armor on. I'm extremely cold again. Um, let's take some healing. Should knock us back. Why is it extremely cold here? Oh, I don't know. Let's get in there. I can't believe I came here with no bloody spicy food. That's pathetic. Is it just this location or is it fighting the golem that does this? If I back off. I'm still dying. Take some more healing. Right, he's down, he's down. Um, let's come all the way down here. Look at him. Evil brute. Why is it still extremely cold? Right, Lean's... You're going to attack Lean? I'm oh, going for the horse, of course. I'm oh, just very cold here. I'm trying to find a pick. Uh, let's put that down there. 
Let's chop this guy up. Thank you. I'll some rock crystal out of this one. And some goldstone as well. Yeah, um, let's come down. I think it's just extremely cold up there. It's just very cold here. So let's... Yeah, strangely familiar act. I'm going to get... Oh, no, don't do that. I'm trying to get Leon down. How do I do that? Stop it, I've forgotten the instructions. <laughs> I can't remember the instructions to get him down. To recall him. Oh, he's not following, is he? He's not following. Right, you can follow. <laughs> yeah. Come, come, Leon, 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 I want to rescue you. Come on. Come down here. Leon, 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 come away, come away. There we go, no, no, down there. Come on, return. Come down here. Thank you, Leon. Well done, well done. Because it's just extremely cold up there, it seems like. This bastard, though. I took, yeah, I could think of some ruder words than bastard. Ah. Sit, Leon, come on. Come, Leon, save my life, please. Thank you, Leon. <laughs> well done. Let's just use up this axe on him. On the way. Okay, let's just go in there. Leon is suffering. I'm trying to get away from this fucking thing. Nah. Nah. Down, down, down. This thing is too big. It's much too big. It's really quite unfortunately large. <laughs> Leon, well, I'm distracting it. You could at least try to attack it. Right, Leon's have recovered a little bit, though. Oh, right, the thing doesn't seem to be attacking me here, does it? It seems to be okay, but it's got so much health, this thing. Oh, that's it, that's it. Just get its kneecapped. Kneecap it, kneecap it. It does seem to be quite, you know, subdued down here. But no, we're not making any impression on this thing. I don't understand, look. Oh, Lord. We were doing better before. Oh, of course, I'm, I've not got the stuff on. I've not got my stuff. Uh, put it on, put it on. There we go. That's the reason. Can Leon wear this stuff? Controls wear body paint. Leon's okay. He's doing very well down there. I thought this was just for defense, this body paint. I didn't realize it gave you a better attack. But this thing's going down. We're going down, you MF. Just chop at his nads. Chop those nads. Chop those nads, Gaudia. <laughs> oh, wrong end, actually, for the nads. We don't want to go up into the hills. Oh, right, that's gone. Uh, we knew that was going to happen. Graceful night. Are oh, we going too high again? Oh. Less than half health now. We can do this. Oh, Leon's, Leon's health is good. We're doing well. Come on. Cover that stamina. The mouth is not very aggressive at all. Very good. I'm pleased to hear that. Oh, God almighty. Right, back off, back off, back. There we go. Now, slash the bastard. He's almost dead. Well, I say almost. He's on the verge of dead. Yeah, he's on the way to dead. Ooh. That's it. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, you can do it. You can do it, Gaudia. I believe in you. <laughs> oh, he's down, he's down. The great bastard. Ah. Oh. Um, right, come on, let's get all this. What is that? Brand of the Mammoth. Oh, I need that, don't I? Annulled fangs. Very good. Right, let's chop him up. Let's get the axe up. 
Oh, I'm pretty pleased about that. Get you. Oh, God almighty. Right, elephant hide. Right, so it's just that and, and demon blood. So nothing else particularly good. Wow, that was exciting as it turned out. I enjoyed that. <laughs> what we could do, we could try and do the others, couldn't we? Have we got enough of this body paint, do you think, to last us? I don't know. Um, I'm going to get dressed. And then we shall go uh, down south again. We might buy some more of this body paint. I'm going to see if I can give some of this to Leon. I don't know if that's possible to do. Yeah, we'll experiment, we'll experiment. We'll go down south again, buy some more clobber, and then we shall go to the pirate camp, I think. That'll be good. Right, let's get going. Back again, chased here by rock donkeys. They're giving up. Come on, give up, you bastards. The Arna and Leon sorting them out. He'll manage, I'm sure. Right, let's have a word with you. We need some more of this stuff, don't we? Lovely weather for a hunt, eh? Certainly is. Happy hunting. Happy hunting. Uh, can I get over there? Oh, please just go over to the end there. Thank you. I'll buy one of those. And another one, I think. They're quite cheap. I'll have another lure, just in case. Just in case I waste one. And I've got... How many teeth have I got left? I've got 31. I don't know what these other scrolls do. God, you need a thousand teeth for that? Bloody hell! So are these just recipes to make stuff? Yeah, there must be. That's a spike trap. There's a throne of Jebel Sag. Skull Warhammer. Bloody hell, the thousand! That's insane! Basin of Jebel Sag, great. Uh, red biomolescent. <laughs> sorry, red biomolescent mushroom. Of course, they're only fifty though. Cheap, and you got some wall paints and stuff. And then there's a wear hyena hunter, which I'm guessing is like a, a companion. Damn it! Okay, I've got to collect lots of teeth. So we've got that. Let's look on the map. See where we're going next. Because yeah, it's not too far to go. We are going to go over here. So this is an old stamping grounds for us. We're very familiar with that. So I won't bore you with the journey. Okay, let's not crash into that. Go down over here. Yeah, we've got to head in this direction. Go past the oasis. And then past the savannah area. And then we'll come to that big ship. It's a big lump of rock, really. But it looks a bit like a ship. So I'll see you in a minute. Okay, so we're at the savannah. There's the savannah over there. Oh, hello, a tiger. Nice. Got the lovely wall here. That's the wall to the cold north. I can't remember what this area is called. It is called Boundary Spillway. Very nice, isn't it? Very interesting. Got a massive, well, got a very dangerous three skull tiger here. So we'll run straight past you. <laughs> Goodbye. And where we want is just around the corner, more or less. There's the fortress of Elmira, I think it's called, isn't it? I've still not attacked that in any successful way. But never mind, one day. Oh, hello. Yeah, so the ship is over there. Just see it on that side. But I don't think we've been over here in this playthrough. I think this is the first time we've seen the ship in this playthrough. But the rock donkeys aren't dangerous at all, but you get sand reapers here, which can be quite nasty. But what we've got to do is go down one of these gullies. Go down to the river level. So down here, I think, from memory. Here we go. There'll be a few pirates hanging about. And then we've got to keep an eye out for one of those altar stones. So here are the pirates. Hi guys. Yeah, yeah. Right, builds water break. And I think I can... Yeah, there it is, right in front of us. Look. The Black Galleon. And I think the creature here is... Oh, bloody hell, you bastard. 
Yeah, the creature here is a rhinoceros. Well done, well done. Do they have anything worth pinching? I did notice a chest up here. Anything good? I doubt it. Uh, no, not really. <laughs> yeah, I'll take the bedroll though. That might be quite good. Uh, and I can, yeah, and I can afford that tent. I will take the tent actually. Right, so we know the drill. Uh, I was thinking about putting, you know, this wall paint on Liam, but I'd have to take him out of the armour. Uh, well, should we just see if it'll work on him at all? Can I give it to him and then get him to do something with it? How do I get him to... Did you get your wall paint on then? I didn't just take it back, did I? Oh, no, I think I put it on myself. Damn. Um, okay, okay. Well, we might do that some other time. <laughs> we know what works. So let's just get our clothes off. I'll strip down to your undies. Let's go over here. Uh, right, put a bedroll down first. I did make one on the way, but... Uh, da, 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 where's the green one I made? Don't want to reappear back in the cold north, do I? I did make one. Where is it? Damn it! Well, I'll take one of the uh, raw hide ones. Put you down there. Too far away from what? Building not allowed. Okay, yeah. We're too close to the galleon. You've got to go all the way up here, I think. I know you can put things in the thralls, you know, inventories and make them use them, like potions, but I, I keep forgetting how to do it. Oh, this is a pain in the arse, isn't it? Come on. Right, we should be able to build up here somewhere. Come on, anywhere, on a bit of rock. Damnation. There, I had it then, I'm sure I did. Oh, perhaps not. Yeah. Bloody hell. Overlapping. There, come on, that's lovely and flat. Oh, you, there, thank you. Thank you very much for nothing. Well, this is going to run out, isn't it? No, I, sh I think we should be okay. I'm being a little bit melodramatic, perhaps. Oh, these guys have respawned. Oh, ridiculous. Come on, let's polish them off. Thank you, sir. Okay. Oh, she has some nice stuff. I won't pick it up now, though. Yeah, yeah this spear is Hanuman's pike, I think. Is it? Yes, oh, staff of Hanuman. It's quite good. Uh, da, da, da. Yeah, we got it from Hanuman's grotto. Anyway, let's get some of that stuff down. Where's it gone? Alright, there we go. Champion's lure. Good. Nice. Let's get the old graceful knight up. Where are you? Oh, 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 here he comes. Is that a rhino? Oh, with bloody hell it is. Crap. Damn it. Right, just kill it. I don't think we're safe enough in here. Oh, perhaps not. <laughs> Famous last word. Uh, right, there's healing. Uh, I did quite like this place for night. It's very good. I quite like the katanas, I must say. I do spend a lot of time hiding behind my shield, but the action on these swords is very pleasant. Over here, please. Over here. Yeah. Try to keep behind it. Good. Try and lock on. Oh, I'm cutting its throat here. Right, now go for bollocks again. Whatever's up there. I don't care. Okay, yeah. About a third down, I think. 
Or perhaps a torch, I don't know. Ooh-ah! Ian's really enjoying himself. Oh, you tanky bastard! Get the fuck off! <laughs> I think there's a lot of health left on this katana. So I'm not going to worry about it. Yeah, running out. I like that axe. Okay, wow. Right, we are down to a third health here. Oh, back again. Ah. Oh, oh, thumbnail, thumbnail. There we go. Oh, yeah, these guys aren't putting up too much of a fight, I have to say. Famous last words. Another thumbnail. Oh. <laughs> you know it's an easy fight, and I'm looking for thumbnail opportunities. <laughs> Come on, you said it's an easy fight. He's going to kill you now, isn't he? Come, get out of it. Get out of the bloody thing. Look at this. Uh, a bit of hello. Play it safe, Gaudia. Play it safe. Don't show off. That's a corpse. We have a corpse. Alright, take all that. Let's chop him. Or him or her or whatever. Where's the axe? Um, well, we're not using that shield, are we? Chop, chop. All right, full of helium, this one. Good. Well, just some rhino hide and exotic flesh, but we weren't really expecting anything else, were we? Good. Well, let's put that down. Um, there's no real point getting dressed, is there? So now we have got to go to... Yeah, we've got to go over here. And it might be quicker. Oh, I don't know though. I was going to say it might be quicker if we went home and used the map room. Because we have learnt um, a location here. I think it's going to be quicker just to ride though. So let's get on the horse. We'll go downstream. Then we'll turn left, go down to the sea. And yeah, that shouldn't take us too long. But I'll cut around that. Almost there, almost there. We are just on the very edge of this like peninsula bit here. And I should have mentioned that you get the locations of these um, altar stones from the lady who, you know, we saw at that um, that big place. <laughs> the big place, you know, the place where the, the light was coming out of. We spoke to the guy on the right hand side. But if you speak to the lady in the middle, then she will tell you more or less where these people are, these bosses are. Come on, get it over and done with, please. So we've got to look around here somewhere. Uh, where could it be? Pretty sure it's around here. Oh, I'm not seeing anything. Is that? Oh no, it's just a croc. Did we go past it? We might have done that. Come on, Alter. Where are you? I think the boss you see here is like a Jaguar or something. Good grief. Where is it? <laughs> Where is it? Have we ridden straight past it? Oh, I'm not seeing anything here. Uh, it wouldn't be this far down, would it? Well, I say that like I know, but I don't. All I know is that it's at the end here somewhere. Somewhere on this slight peninsula bit. Ah, oh, nothing to be seen. It must be right around the corner, perhaps. Wouldn't be over there, surely. Let's look at all this. Anything here? No. Oh, come on. Bloody hell. Oh, 
I'm running past it, I know it. Absolutely positive I'm running past it. Just not... St oh, there it is! Right, I wasn't. <laughs> God, we're very close to this, aren't we? Okay, um, I'm going to assume I've got a bit of time left with this wall paint. I do quite like the wall paint. That might be quite a good thumbnail. I mean, I think we got some quite good ones. Uh, yeah, it's the rocks in the background. Aren't doing us any favours, are they? Right, let's think about that later. Don't be so vain. Let's get this down. We're all good. How's your healing? 81, that's okay. I will top him up, though. I do have a bit extra here. I'm okay. I shall take some more food, though. And I've got this salted pork. Which is quite good for extra damage. Yeah, 15%. I don't know if that'll work in this case, but put that down here. Ah! And uh, yeah, run away, run away. Where is it? Where is it? Where, where, where it is? Jesus Christ! Okay. I was expecting a panther or a jaguar, so it should be too surprising. Oh, right, damn it! I haven't put a mat down. Okay, let's do that quickly. Death to the Outlander, indeed. You hold him off, Leon. Do your best. Do your best, old chap. Uh, too far away. Don't give me that too far away rubbish. <laughs> I'm wondering where I've got to. Uh, damn it. If this thing swipes me. Another arse attack, please. Yeah, don't get in the dangerous end. Keep this end. Right, Leon's suffering. But we are winning, I think. Yeah, we are winning. In the, he's dying faster than Leon is. Tink, in the nads. Well, I think this one's been spayed. Off. Going down quite handily. Don't die. Don't die, Claudia. Perfect score so far. Yeah. Uh, he's got his half health. Whoa. No, no. Too slow. Facing Zoro here. Whoa. Get away, get away. Sorry for this cat, it's like he's blind. Just lashing out, lashing out randomly. Again. Yeah, no thank you, no thank you. Oh. And again. Oh god almighty. Damn. Right, you nicked me then. Oh, he could try and do, don't do that, don't do that. He's very fast. Give him that. He's taking his vitamins, this one. I got a lot of bleed on him. I will just for the hell of it take some more aloe. Not that I really need it. Oh, oh no. He's not that tough. Oh, and he's down. He is down. Look at that. Right, let's take all your stuff, please. And I will chop you to bits. Get the hatchet up again. Thank you. Oh. oh, I've got a panther head, demon blood, blah, blah, blah. Usual stuff. Some useful demon blood. Right. Okay, stop doing that, Gaudia. Stop it. She's got very tense all of a sudden. Right, I think we should leave it there for the day. We've done quite a lot. I was only expecting to do one of these people. But no, we nobbled all three. And the next step is to take the brands that we've collected and use those in some sort of charm. I think we have to travel to the lair of Jebel Sag or the Midnight Garden and then create another lure for this like ultimate boss, which is like a giant werebear or something like that. So we'll try that in the next episode. Well, I thought that was pretty good. Quite exciting, wasn't it? Yeah, I hope you found it fun too. I hope to see you again for the next episode, and until I do see you again, I shall say goodnight.